I'd like to thank everyone for taking the time to click on this video. This month we will be doing a giveaway on your choice of a beaded hummingbird necklace with six intention crystals or a romance angel oracle deck. Last time this deck went out of print, it sold for up to a thousand dollars. If you would like to be entered into the giveaway, simply just click the like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment on which item you would like to receive. We will announce the winner in the last weekly reading of this month. Hello Aquarius, this is Craig from Hacking Spirituality and I'm here to do a love reading on the zodiac sign of Aquarius. Sun, moon, rising, or Venus. Cross watchers are welcome. Not all messages will resonate. If you want a message that's going to resonate more directly to your own personal situation, you can always feel free to reach out to me and book a personal reading. Link to my website will be in the description box down below. So starting out your reading, someone's showing up with the Eight of Pentacles in this relationship, meaning they're doing a lot of investment into work, time, energy is focused highly on research and kind of looking into things online. It could even be self-improvement in some situations. The other person's showing up with the Page of Cups. Now this person definitely wants to extend emotional offers. Um, and receive them as well. This is definitely a brand new energy with the Page of Cups showing up. And you have the Wheel of Fortune showing up as the shared energy. So there was some sort of destiny that led to this event. You guys could have actually met in some sort of awkward way where you really weren't expecting to meet a person at that time. And they just kind of presented themselves to you in your life. You also have the strength card showing up as a blockage. So someone may be having a hard time holding themselves back, holding back, reaching out with too much, too much loving energy, which sounds strange, but you can actually smother a person if you overextend yourself in some situations. So there may be a need for one of you to kind of hold yourselves back and keep it kind of chill and relaxed so the other person doesn't feel awkward in the situation kind of being over oppressed with romantic gestures um you also have the knight of pentacles showing up as the advice so someone definitely does need to take things slow again it kind of reiterates itself right there and not move things along too fast where the other person doesn't feel like they have room to breathe or they feel trapped in the situation at all you have Orbron showing up as your dragon. And if you give me one second, I'm going to look him up in the book. So, two. Okay, so yeah, the advice in this reading as well, secondary advice from your um, Oracle card is reconnect to your physical body, get out of your head. So like I was saying earlier, someone actually may be a little bit caught up in their head they could be taking things too personally too when they're overextending themselves but there's really a need to not overthink this and really slow down the pace that they're moving at and i'm really seeing that come up more on their end and you actually being more invested into work and other things at this time and you really don't want to be bothered with someone who's kind of just overly smothering you in this situation at all. I really hope you enjoyed your reading Aquarius and I look forward to doing your next one.